example from a 2D design. I'll start with this 2D drawing, showing the top, front, and right side views of a coffee mug. Before I get started, I'll select the 3D modeling workspace. This gives me easy access to the most commonly used 3D modeling tools. Now I have the solid, surface, and mesh tabs available on the ribbon. For this video, I'll use tools available from the Home tab. Because 3D objects are easier to create and visualize in a 3D view, I'll hold down the Shift key and Mouse Wheel button while moving the mouse to change the view. I could also change the view using the View Cube. Next, I'll select the shaded visual style from the viewport controls. I'll extrude the 2D base of the mug, giving it a height of 3.8, to create a 3D cylinder for the body of the mug. Now I'll create a circle and give it a radius of 1.5. Next, I'll use Press Pull to create the interior of the mug, giving it a depth of 3.5. Notice how Press Pull subtracts the center of the cylinder. I'll select 3D Align, select the center line of the 2D handle, and press Enter. I'm going to copy and align the 2D handle to the 3D mug. I'll select two base points along the center line of the 2D mug. I'll press Enter to continue through the third base point. Next, I'll select two destination points along the center line of the 3D mug to rotate the handle. For the third destination point, I'll select the end point of this center line to locate the handle to the mug. To complete the handle, I'll select Sweep to sweep the profile of the handle along the 2D path. And finally, I'll orbit around the 3D mug by holding down the Shift key and Mouse Wheel button.